The official concerns and representatives from the UPWC and NCCT met with the media to reveal the progress of their five-day meeting bidding to reach a nationwide peace agreement, Joseph reports. This day 5 meeting is to review on the chapter 5, which is about the structure and roadmap of the political dialogue, find agreement and continue to the last two chapters of the nationwide ceasefire agreement. This seven chapter MC includes 30 sessions and according to the UPWC, they have found agreement on 20 out of 30 sessions. <laughs> What we can say for sure now is we have finalized the chapter 1 to 5 so far without having any problems. We are expecting to finish this NCA tomorrow. According to the UPWC, the major problem in the NCA meeting is the choice of words though. Both sides could reduce many of the disagreements by building up mutual understanding and trust. We still need to discuss how we will be able to hold political dialogues with the participant groups that should participate and how we will invite ethnic from political parties, M groups and other areas to participate in the NCA based on the framework that we have discussed already. And we also need to discuss on the criteria of how and who we will invite after we sign the NCA. According to the NCCT, both sides have agreed that this NCA draft will be submitted to the parliament for approval in order to pass this NCA from the present to the next government. This amendment, demobilization and reintegration DDR, proposed by the military and security sector reform assessor, proposed by NCCT, both should be included in the reconciliation for the security purposes. But it will be discussed by the military and armed group leaders. I will say there is no price which may ask for it. But we will discuss about that tomorrow. While most of the ethnic armed groups participate in these talks to draft an NCA, five remain excluded. And CCD leader Haneva says they will try to bridge gaps between the remaining groups and the government. Joseph Jossain from Nima International Television.